Good morning. This is cold. Holy smokes, it's cold. All right. I got some ice in my beard. Hey there, guys. Good morning. This is ice fishing. Uh, I got taken out this morning uh, by one of my students, actually. He just said, hey, I'd like to take you fishing. Uh, so that is what we're doing today. We're gonna have a good time on the water. We are fishing for a little bit of whatever whatever bites. We're not doing tip-ups today, flip-ups, whatever. I think we're gonna be jigging and hopefully we catch a few species. You guys, if you watched my last video, I caught one walleye, was it? Or maybe it was a maybe it was lake trout. I can't remember what I caught. Nope, take it back. It was a walleye. It was fun. I caught a walleye. Uh, we got up this morning at 4.30, on the road at 4.30, so it's cold. It was negative 7 this morning, absolutely zero wind. Uh, that sun is coming up right now, and it's it's going to be a good day. Our propane heater just malfunctioned, so we might not have a heater today, but that's okay. We're going to make the best of it. We're going to have a lot of fun. All right, guys, let's go. Boom. Let's catch fish, my man. I'm gonna drop a GoPro today, I know it. All right, hey there, guys. Uh, we're fishing, and you can see this water is beautifully clear. Um, we have two jig poles set up, and this guy right here has the Vexlar set up. We're gonna see if we can catch a fish. We got a nice large hole. Uh, that was six separate, um, was that a 10 inch or eight inch auger? 10 inch. 10 inch auger. What species are we looking for today? Uh, today we're looking for salmon and trout. Maybe a couple white fish here and there. Salmon, trout, sturgeon, a couple of carp I think maybe. Yeah. Uh, there we go. Um, maybe even some rock bass. I'd be happy with a rock bass today. Uh, now usually I do catch release wander but today it might be catch release to grease wander. The thing about ice fishing is you're pulling these fish up from so deep. Um, I don't know if these fish have swim bladders, but I know some do. Um, and so it's sometimes releasing in ice fishing doesn't really help save those fish. Um, at least I've heard that before. Maybe I don't know what I'm talking about. Probably don't. No, that's that's okay. He says it's true. Right on. Maybe we'll get a bite while you're on. That'd be pretty sweet. Oh, is that a fish? Oh, that's, no, that's me. Oh my gosh, I just got bamboozled right there. I, I would have sworn that was a fish. It was like just going, ooh. Did you see that? Yeah, just bouncing around the bottom, seeing if I can attract <laughs> anything. Uh, okay, okay. I got bamboozled. We got this Vexlar set up, but you know, Zach here was telling me that when a fish does come and strikes, it's usually a very quick process. They don't, you know, sniff around. They come and they uh, they hammer it right away, um, which is hopefully going to create some really cool action uh, for you guys to watch. Um, you know, we're seeing if we could catch a salmon or maybe a lake trout or, uh, you know, there's a potential to catch even splake out here, which would be kind of cool. Yeah, they're one of the easiest fish out here to catch. Really? Yeah, they'll hit anything. Well, there you go. Splake or dumb. I learned that today. Right there. Come over. What kind of fish? That's a fish. I got it. Holy smokes. See what I mean? We didn't even mark them. Holy smokes, it's a fish. All right, so what is this thing? It's about like a 16 inch coho. All right, beautiful. All right, like I said, this is a release to grease, but that's okay. This is a cool little coho right here. In Alaska, they'd call these a silver salmon. Right on. Yeah. Very cool. Yeah, that water is just, that ice is so beautiful. It looks like they already got it. Just reel up until you can see your jig, then they should come and hit it. That's cool, man. Yeah. That's so cool. There you go. 
That's a fish. Nice. I'm just gonna let him go. That's so cool. That was so cool, you just sight fished that thing. Yeah. <laughs> well, I want to do that. A school of herring just went through and they were following the sage that I was talking about earlier, eating all the little bugs and stuff. And I just played around with one, jigging it above him when he went to hit it. But then I finally just let him hit. It was about 20-ish inches long, a lot bigger than what he's used to catching. It was, it was really cool. So we looked at the Vexlar and it was just like pop, 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 pop. All over the Vexlar, things were going down. And I was like, whoa, whoa, whoa. We looked down in the water and like fairly large fish, I mean like 20 inch fish. And they're just swimming really peacefully through the water. All right, hey there guys. This is probably the midday update. Uh, two fish so far in the shack. We got one of them right there. Our little coho. Um, we also caught a really big Cisco. Let that one go. We're still trying to get a fish for me, um, but we're having fun. It is, uh, ice fishing is just a different thing. It's something I'm not really yet that used to. Um, but I really like jigging. Jigging seems more enjoyable than setting up tip-ups, and, and uh, we're having fun. Uh, the Vexlar keeps it interesting, and uh, stick with it. Hopefully we're going to get some more fish. Hopefully. Fish, I'm not trying to like make it look massive. All right. All right. This one was a planted brown. Planted? Yeah, he doesn't have that fin right there. They clip them. There we go. End of the day, and I got a nice fish. All right, hey guys, this is the wrap. Uh, it was a good day. It was a fun day. We marked a lot of fish. Didn't get those fish to bite, but that's okay. Um, just, I mean, just a minute ago, we had a we had a fish right here on our Vexlar. Good things were happening, but we couldn't get that fish to bite. Uh, we had a really early morning and we are heading back. We caught one big Cisco today and one kind of petite coho, uh, but that's okay. We had a good time. We had a lot of fun. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, soon, open water will be back. You know, even though I'm sitting here in like 10 inches of solid ice, I'm talking about open water, but it's coming sooner or later. Um, hope you guys enjoyed it. Right on. Have a wonderful day. Catch, release, wander. I'll see you guys in the next one.